When running a multifocal ERG, make sure that your patient is comfortably seated in front of the monitor. You can adjust the height of the table, the chin rest, or the camera. Once the patient is comfortably seated in front of the monitor, we make sure that they can see the red fixation mark in the center of the screen. If the patient cannot see the red fixation mark, we can enlarge it by clicking Stimulus and changing the size and width of the X. Only change it as much as necessary, trying to make as much of the hexagon visible as possible. When the patient can see the red X, close the window. Next we check our impedance. If everything is below 10, we can close the window and preview the signal. The signal looks clean. If the patient blinks, we will see that coming through and we will be notified that a blink is detected. During the test, the patient should blink as seldom as possible. Every time a blink is detected, three milliseconds will be taken off the length of the test and that data will be re-recorded. We tell our patient to sit still, look straight at the X, try not to move and try not to blink. Is our patient ready? Yes. Then we click on run. Do you want to continue? Testing both eyes, yes. And the test begins recording. If you would only like to test one eye, you would choose that here before starting the test. When the test is recording, there are two bars to look at. The total progress bar and the per section progress bar. There are usually eight sections to this protocol and at the end of a section you will hear a chime. We ask our patient to blink. Three, two, one, click run to continue going on with the test. Again we check in with our progress bars. In this section we are about 30 percent. Of the total test we have about 15%. We can give our patient short pauses to blink or momentarily close their eyes, but we try not to drag out the pauses so that the test goes swiftly. Go between pausing and running until the test is complete. When the test is complete, the patient can sit back. You'll see the words, test finished, as the status. At this point, go ahead and exit and save the test. To view the test, click Old Tests and load it. 